but like not right now because right now we gotta watch this i mean you literally tried to that's the intro her. you know what <laughs> you hey guys it's wanda one here and today i'm gonna be talking about the most toughest determined wait pride hey guys it's wanda one here and juan you did he say juan or juan have i been saying it wrong have i been saying your name wrong the entire time bro if i have i'm sorry hey guys it's wanda one here and today no it's juan it's juan i'm right i'm right i'm right i should have never died about character in all of anime that's right You've guessed it, this character is none other than Vegeta, the Prince of All Saiyans. So with Prince Cap. Vegeta being the topic of- Oh my god, who's bro? Bro's barber? Bro, get off him, bro. Get off him, bro. He's the natural since day one. Let's talk about how he is one of the biggest frauds in the DBZ franchise. Damn. That's right, I've said it. Vegeta is one of the biggest frauds in Dragon Ball. <laughs> so Vegeta fanboys, strap in. Because I'll be clowning Damn. on Vegeta this entire video. Oh, and before I get into the video, I should tell y'all that this video is really only for comedic purposes. So to all y'all about to flame me. I thought he said, I thought he was this video sponsored. I was finna, <laughs> I was finna be like, Damn, you sponsored already? Give me one. <laughs> Give me one. His gotcha. forehead is insane. Get off him, bro. Wait, are you... See, who are you talking about? Are you talking about him, 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 or him? Because there's like... <laughs> there's like four different options. We went through four niggas, bro. Vegeta's forehead is crazy, bro. Have you seen... Bro, hold on. 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 Uh... <laughs> this nigga without hair looks this <laughs> oh my god oh my god this nigga without hair looks disgusting uh Danny Tatum is disgusting. Yeah, let's talk about how he is one of the okay. entire video. Oh, and before I get into the video, I should tell y'all that this video is really only for comedic purposes. So to all y'all about bro. me in the comments, calm down. Grab a snack, a drink. I'm gonna down, call you an N word after this. Right, after this stream, bro. That's all I want to talk about y'all with Vegeta is when this man gets cooked by the very organism that killed off his entire species. Now during this arc, I'm not gonna lie, Vegeta was cooking. He was going against some random we didn't know about, but he absolutely cooked against them. He got his wins. Okay, I was like, oh yeah, Absolutely. his aura was at an all time high. But all of a sudden, he encounters Frieza. And you know, he's talking mad. Bro, got a crazy edge. At an all Hold time on. high. Look at this. But all of a sudden, I got a crazy edge. I need to do that shit. All of a sudden, he. Why he bulging like that? <laughs> he encounters <laughs> Bro, he encounters Frieza. Frieza, and you know he's talking mad crazy to Frieza, talking about how he's the legendary Super Saiyan and all this yada yada yada. But then he just gets absolutely cooked by Frieza. I mean, imagine getting I mean, cooked by a racist that you was. Okay, first off, first off, first off, I'm not even a Frieza. I'm not even a Vegeta lover like that. Oh, it's it's Goku to the day I die. But like, Frieza is like top two villains in the world at this point, and he's not two. Like, we are talking about someone. Who can destroy planets with a single finger in his first form? How many niggas could do that? In 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 Dragon Ball Z, how many niggas could do that, bro? Frieza was a different breed. And then if you look at the spirituals and the context of the situation, Vegeta was fighting Frieza since first form, and then he fought Frieza all the way up to his final form. There's four forms, by the way. So he fought through all four forms and then got one shot. I don't want to defend Vegeta though. So I'm going to let you spit. He was talking mad crazy too. But now all of a sudden we have Vegeta over here trauma dumping to Goku. Kakarot, listen to me closely, Kakarot. That man you see before you was truly evil. So could you. Oh, that's crazy. Trauma dumping. You didn't have to say that way. Get off of my nigga's forehead, bro. Look. As two niggas, as two niggas with giant foreheads, we gotta band together. You know? We gotta stick together. Our hairlines are one. You are my fan! What am I doing with my hands? Our hairlines are one, bro. Get off my nigga. He good. All he needed is some Bosley. All he needed is some Bosley, some keeps, and a prayer. He, he gonna be fine in six months. 
Damn, get off my man. Listen to me close. He ends up marrying a billionaire. What you doing with your life? Not shit. Not shit. You ain't married to a billionaire. That's all I know. Kakarot, that man you see before you was truly evil. So could you hurry up? I have to meet a shoddy over at Planet Garden Sector 9. He's forced the saints As to work for him for so long. Your father and even my father were even killed after he blew up our home planet. Well, that's cool and all, Vegeta, but considering your track record... Forget about me and focus on him. We worked so hard for him. He also took our Saiyan shoddies. One of them being my own mother. I've shot you through the heart. How are you even still alive? I've suffered under this evil freak. You're alive to see that nigga. Please, Kakarot. <laughs> Do it for your Saiyan pride. I mean, you literally tried to kill everyone on Earth. You know what? F*** you. <laughs> Finally. All right, so up next is when this man Vegeta gets absolutely we, we, waxed. Okay, listen, listen. We don't, we don't, we don't talk about this part. We don't talk. Why am I defending Vegeta so hard? I'm not a Vegeta fan, bro. Maybe I am. Maybe I, maybe, maybe it took somebody talking shit about my mans to just like really open up that avenue of like admiration and respect. Vegeta's vegetable in your mouth. Oh my god, bro. I'm just trying to give him his accolades. Because the show don't give it to him. Jawan ain't gonna give it to him. Somebody gotta defend him, bro. What I just finished saying. Big foreheads gotta unite. I'm not gonna let you talk shit about my mans. But this was an L on his part, bro. This was an L. You can't just talk crazy shit and then get your ass beat. You got your ass beat by an 18-year-old girl at like 27. Like, I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna let you spit, though. I'm gonna let you spit. By Android so Vegeta, coming off Vegeta not helping me. Vegeta helped me several times. What are you talking about? How many times have you saved the world? You ain't saved the world as many times as Vegeta did. Every time he saved the planet, he's helped me. How many times have you helped me, nigga? He ain't real, nigga. You ain't real. All of y'all are ab ab. ab Shut up. Vegeta being the person he is encounters Android 18. And this man is straight up cocky from the get go. And I mean, that W to his hand got him way too gassed up, but it don't matter. Cause listen, listen, bro. Listen, listen, listen. Because I'm going to defend my mans to the death. What can I say here to, to defend my Why aren't you talking about her forehead? Look at, look at her dome. Her dome is as big as Vegeta's. You put a widow's peak on her, on her shit. <coughs> oh, damn. 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 Never mind. Never mind. I'm gonna let you I'm gonna I'm gonna let you get it off. Android 18 by the humble bro, P So at the beginning with this fight, Android 18 decides to get the first lick on Vegeta. But Vegeta says hell not, nah, so he right. hits her with the classic headbutt. Exactly. Exactly. Bodied her. her. Immediately hits her with that Exactly, bro. Exactly, bro. I don't even need to play the video after this. We, he he beat her. Three hit combo. She, he let her get that first hit off. I don't even need to play the rest of the video. Like what do what do we what do we what do we even talk about here, bro? What do we even talk about? I'm, 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 um, to the sea fighters, and they're absolutely shocked that Vegeta is giving 18 the worst. It's exactly. Just, we all know why Krillin is shocked because he don't want his girl to go, Jeez, man. You know, you feel me? Hey, hey Krillin, why am I right. holding the mic? Because I'm, man. you can say it. But I'm scared that if I hold it up like this, that y'all not going to be able to hear me because I'm leaning back. I'm leaning back because I'm comfortable. I'm leaning back because I'm comfortable. They don't know what's about to come next. Trust. Moving forward, we come to realize he did not get cut, bro. Absolutely. She stupid. got inf She's hacking, bro. She's literally hacking. She got infinite energy, bro. She's literally. She's literally hacking. Give my man infinite energy and put him on the same playing field. My nigga had. My nigga had to fight against a renewable energy source. <laughs> my fucking get off my nigga's forehead. We are forehead brothers, bro. We are forwarding the forehead community together. Get off my mans. <laughs> so Vegeta gets right back to throwing them things with 18. But exactly. Push her back. That off. Now let this be a lesson to y'all. If you're trying your absolute hardest against someone and they're blocking all your punches with ease, go hit that Joe Star technique and get oh my to gosh. hit it. But as you can see here, Vegeta does not care and he continues to waste his energy. Because he's, he, he's not a bitch. Because he's not a bitch. Because he's not a bitch. Because he's not a bitch. Who, who, who running, bro? Who running when you really not bitch, bro? You know? Sometimes you just gotta sometimes you really gotta stand up to the opposition and let them know that at the end of the day. Do you see the forehead lit Oh my fucking god? This is a crazy frame. This is a crazy frame. 
But actually, 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 if you, uh, if you really zoom in and look at the spirituals, you will see that, uh, yeah, I'm about to say, her forehead is bigger than Vegeta's. So really, 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 bigger forehead equals bigger power level. Let's really talk about that. With no prevail. But then it gets to that moment, the moment that will forever change Vegeta's life. And to this day, Vegeta has yet to recover from this moment. Vegeta really- what you mean he yet to recover from this moment, bro? Everybody didn't had a broken arm before. Relax. I ain't never had a broken arm, but that's not, that's not the point. Everybody didn't had a broken arm before. Relax. Realizes that Android 18 has been toying with him this whole time. Better scramble like an egg before you get folded like an omelet, nigga. Oh my god. Now oh my, you did not have to zoom in on his face. Arm, like how Mariah Mills is holding on to Zion. Anyways, this is the end for part one of this video. I really hope y'all- Part one? Like and subscribe. I what you mean part one? There's no more- <laughs> See, bro. See, bro. This had the opposite effect. This made me a Vegeta fan, bro. If there are a hundred Vegeta fans, I'm one of them. If there's one Vegeta fan, it's me. If there are zero Vegeta fans, I fucking died. This had the opposite effect. I'm defending Vegeta to my dying breath, bro. We can, we can, we can, we can meet up in the street and, and, and buck up right now. Don't do that. Don't do that. You said you play football. I'm not, I'm not having it. If I see you in the street trying to fight me, bro, I'm going to ask you how your day been. But get off my mans. Get off my mans. We forehead brothers.